Oh, bruh. Hey, do this to me. There we go. Is that better? Yeah, maybe move it down a little bit. Or That's fine. I mean, whatever works, bruh. Yeah, there you go, perfect. Alright, nice. 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 You're gonna have some nice audio. It's always a little challenging uh, playing in Moody uh, because I can't hear too well, so it's kind of hard to concentrate on uh, everyone around me and kind of accompanying them um, and being able to fit in in a mix. Uh, so it was kind of a challenge, but it wasn't really too bad. It was just kind of an adjustment. So I would say probably the biggest thing just overall was just my guitar. My favorite part was just playing with my friends, performing every night, just hanging out and jamming and really uh, locking in and just having fun no matter what song it was. Even if it was a song I didn't like, I still had fun and, and I got to play with some of my best friends. Okay, just show me like, kind of, like go to the rest or... Okay. Uh, we need to work on this transition. Yeah, we're not sure why Biggest challenge that we faced um, preparing for the event is the amount of time you have, which is not very much. But that's exciting because we had seven rehearsals about before we hit sing song week and we're learning between 15 and 20 pieces of music, um, which is crazy. A lot of the pieces we will have maybe played through one time before we actually hit Sing Song Week. And um, so we're putting things together um, kind of like a Las Vegas style show. And, and I tell the students, it's a professional experience. You come in, you read the charts, you do the performance. and. Um, so that's a very big challenge, but it's also an, an incredible opportunity for our students at ACU. Uh, honestly, the, my favorite part of Sing Song, and it, this occurred to me last year, is just being able to uh, play with my best friends and be able to jam out and really just have a good time and perform with them. It was, it was pretty crazy, honestly. Like, uh, we had rehearsals, you know, of course. Like, I was rehearsing the Pi Kappa Act, and then, um, you know, playing gigs around town, playing with Abilene Phil, um, and then uh, that was my work. And then just teaching lessons, and then um, school. School was definitely pretty, pretty crazy, and balancing that with my personal life was, was pretty rough. Uh, but ended up working out, and it's all good now, so. Is there anything you want to tell people who don't know about the jazz band? Is there anything I want to tell people who don't know about the jazz band? Well, let me tell you, um, the jazz band has some of the most incredible musicians um, right here at ACU, and they're, they're largely, uh, they go unnoticed because the singers are the ones that are getting noticed on the stage. But those kids down in the pit, are every bit the musician that you see singing in those microphones. And they don't get the, the visual recognition, but they get the audio recognition. We need to make sure we appreciate them and that we understand how really gifted and talented that they are and they are doing an outstanding job at this show every year.